It's starting. Back at High Point, I wasn't sure your brother would survive the day. He nearly didn't. I was terrified when you called Lud's bluff, but you knew exactly what you were doing. And now Ryan will be coming home. He'll sleep in his bed, eat at our table. He'll be right here, where he belongs. We'll celebrate once Ryan has returned safely. We still need to make the trade. You're right, of course. Still, you did well today. Don't lose sight of that. My lord, look. Where are the gods? Dahlia? Duncan! Where are the Glenmores? Where's anybody? <laughs> Wait here. <laughs> Come on! Don't be so dreary. It was a joke. I'm sorry, I... I should have laughed. Or maybe you think you can do better. Of course not. I... I didn't mean to offend you. Perhaps a song instead. I hear you've written a touching song about your dead brother. Am I in it? Let's hear it, shall we? No. No? I won't. I want... Roderick! Roderick! Welcome back. We've had a lovely time together. Haven't we, Tarly? Say it. Say it's been lovely. It's been... lovely. And you? I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. Ethan was the first Forester I killed. Doesn't have to be the last. You don't know what you're in for, Garrett. What you're asking my brother to do, the North Grove isn't what you think it is. You claim to be a leader, yet your own people do not respect you. But we did as you commanded! These aren't cell swords, Asha. They're killers. Roderick! I can't believe I trusted him. I know you and my brother were in contact. Perhaps he told you things. Things that might prove his guilt. Perhaps you're not to be trusted either. Oh, you're not listening, Garrett. Shh! 